Garrison asked me about Aoyama Technical College, my first work, designed in 1988, 34 years ago. So I start from this work. The site of Aoyama Technical College is chaotic, but I think it's not a chaos. There may be exist some invisible structures deep beneath the surface. It is the same for other cities, nature, our brain, or even the universe. So my question is, what is it? Why is it? Who did it make? It's an enigma. So I always seeking to identify invisible confounding factors under the visible surface. Seeking for the answer. There are three ways. One is just put enigma versus enigma. Use our imagination. It goes to art and design. The second way is to use logic. Goes to science. And the third, just put an answer to enigma using AI. So image is black box. Logic science is white box. AI, PBM, is black box again. My works are a kind of journey seeking to identify the confounding factors. So these are the actual works on these three tracks. The first track is image. I am a technical college is one of them and these are my drawings on the website holding on a three-dimensional space. And the second track, the first one is induction design, 1994. Induction design is composed of induction design is composed of sub programs, sunlight, street, undulation, energy, wind, and facilities, and they make a whole city. In design process, we have to solve so complicated relationships, but it's not possible to solve it with our brain. One way is write down the inside of our brain, externalization of the design process. This point is related to today's subject by Garrison. Sangot City is one example of induction design. It maximizes getting sunlight for every housing unit. And this is the opposite one when go to city. It minimizes the accepting energy for all housing units. And there are many other programs in induction design. This is not for planning, but structure optimization. Nowadays, so-called generative design is popular, but the KDK program is far earlier than them. This is another realized example by algorithmic design substation Idabashi web frame. This is not the opening ceremony of Beijing Olympic, but Fiber Web 2 at Venezia Biennale 22 years ago. It is not algorithmic design, but uses the algorithm inside nature, inside wind. So the third track. This is the world first architecture generated by AI, I think, in 2005. Here, I used neural network and genetic algorithm to create the 3D form of this architecture, TX Tsukuba Express Station. The reason that I use the AI is algorithmic design cannot treat non-describable conditions like our emotion, like or dislike. AI has a possibility, not sure, but maybe treat this kind of non-disclaimer condition. 
This is ongoing project, Project Beautiful Mind. The aim of PBM is to find a favorite form for a designer that he unconsciously desired. To treat all the parameters at once is impossible, but PBM can combine all of them in a single line in a multidimensional space and repeats this dialogue process. It's a contradiction, starting from black box, going through white box, and arrived at black box again. I and we are on the circle. So these three tracks are not independent. This image shows one of the relations. So, the journey will continue. Thanks.